Good morning, YouTube. Um, I'm still in the bed, but I woke up and jumped on YouTube. Famous on YouTube. I told you I'm addicted to it, and I am about to do um, my reaction video. Um, thanks to Busy Mother, I do see that she um found this video. So usually, what she finds, sometimes I just go and find it too and do it. So that's where I got it from. Um, it's actually. I found it on a different website when I googled it. It's actually one man one jar dot com. I don't know if this is. Her says one man one glass. This is one man one jar. So um, I'm about to go and look early in the morning, and I'm already. Finally, they adjust the viscosity by adding a powder thickener. If liquid soap is right, they will come out of the dispenser. After 15 minutes of mixing, the soap oh will be the oh, shit. A sample assessing its physical and chemical properties. When the batch gets the okay, it proceeds to the packaging machine. This soap is going into dispenser bags made of plastic film. The machine first inserts a valve. It heat seals the film, forming the bottom of the bag. Then it injects 27 ounces of soap. Next, it simultaneously heat seals the top of the bag and the bottom of the next one. It cuts them apart, releasing the finished bag to a conveyor belt. Yeah, it did it bleed in bag. After checking for leaks, workers insert a spout that controls output from the valve. This ensures the dispenser will release a measured amount of soap per push. Elsewhere in the factory, an automated machine called the pressure filter pumps dishwashing liquid into plastic bottles. An overflow of I'm fucking running right this video! It needs to be over! I can't watch it no more. Okay, I'm sorry to give away this video, but, um, it doesn't really need to be watched that long after he does what he does, but, <laughs> oh, yeah, I swear, that's definitely not what's, uh, one man, one job.com, y'all find it there, peace.